Hey everyone, welcome back to another Exo Zeros video. So today's video, we're going to talk about the usage PvP for the monthly ranking as of May 16, 2021. But before that, if you want an updated and fresh Exo Heroes episodes, please click the subscribe button. It's actually down below. Okay, to start off this video, we're going to discuss the top usage heroes in PvP last April 18. So if you're going to take a look at these um, rankings in terms of 1 to 10, um, this is actually dominated. This was actually dominated by um, you have their Linombe and you have their um, Wasted Red and also Greenland. Plus, of course, you have their Schmidt. So let's take a look at what we have or what data we have for May 16. So for May 16, it's more or less the same. Aside for a couple of adjustments, um, we'll start from the least part, which is number 11. So Talia in Bathory dropped from 9 and 10 to 10 to 11. I'm sorry, it's no longer the top 10, but the top 11 because Talia and Bathory have the same percentage. So what's new, what dropped them is actually Maggie at number 9. Then... You have there at 7 and 8, FC Garf and FC Rera just switched places because, again, Garf's usage is actually up because of her rework, of course, for her Fated and Fate course. And next would be FC Zio at 6, no change. FC Barak at 5th, uh, no change as well. FC Rachel and FC Rudley actually swap from 2 to 4 and 4, and, uh, four to 2. So, Rachel is now at 4th with minus 2 drop. FC April, no change at number 3. FC Ruddy, plus 2 at number 2. And, of course, FC Schmidt leads the pack at number 1 in terms of usage. So, let's move on to the teams that are being used. Um... Number one, first of all, for the for, for the 14 usage, April, FC April, FC Rachel, FC Zion, and FC Baraka and FC Schmid. This actually has not really gone down that much. I think only one or two users. Um, but they still remain in the top spot. Next would be Bathory, Rera, uh, FC Talde, FC Rudley, and FC Schmid. This actually has gone down a bit. I think one from the previous uh, month. Um, the third one, this is actually a um, a climb up. So, FC Garf, FC Rudley, FC Maggie, FC Ramji, and FC Schmidt actually now at sixth. So, more or less, this is actually a war of three nations already. So, you have their Linombe at one. Um, you also have um, you also have Greenland at two. Then you have Wasted Red at three, and. For number fourth, you have there another team under Linombe minus Schmidt. So this is actually more or less a purely Linombe team, which people are still using, especially if they haven't leveled up Schmidt that much. Then at number five, you have their Shell, FC Shell, FC Jinai, Redley, Garf, and Maggie. Kind of a old meta, but is still being used right now. Um, I, re I really do hope that Janai or FC Janai and FC Shell or Storage Republic in general would get a bit of a bump because there's a lot of potential really in that team or in that nation. Um, I only trust three uh, heroes there, Shell, Janai, and Adams. The rest, I do hope they would improve or core reverse or probably, you know, add, add improvements to Janai. Um, there are some in the community that have told me that her kit needs improvement um, also for FC Shell. And actually, Adams had a good recent core reverse. So more or less, again, we need more help for Storage Republic. The last one with two usage there is FC Garf, Rudley, uh, Maggie, Ramji, and Jean. So this is more or less uh, another version where Jean is in... And Jean's usage is actually climbing up. There are a lot of... I've encountered a lot of questions asking about Jean, whether they should unleash potential, whether they should invest. Well, 
from my take is it's always a it's always a gamble when you invest um just see if a hero or a character has potential to go or to bring your team over the top but i think gene is above average she's uh he's not really that very very good she uh he's actually more on the above average um going to good okay <laughs> if you know what i mean but more or less um i haven't even a niche potential my gene i'm still waiting for uh, my Maggie to be unleashed potential. So more or less, I still have, you know, I still, uh, I'm still ways behind in terms of offering a very powerful FC Gene for Wasted Red. But I think FC Gene has really a lot of potential. So more or less, it's it's usually up to the user on which um, Gene can be used in his team. But again, it's how you use him in uh, in uh, pvp that matters sorry for that okay so just plugged in my laptop sorry for the intermission so more or less let's proceed to the nation usage ranking so in terms of nation again lenom base number one uh up to now there's no disputing that they have taken, you know, they have ruled the number one spot based on fast attacks, based on relentless attacks, um, especially with Schmidt in the in in the picture. Um, that is actually I already kind of thought about it when Schmidt came out that this team would really be the one to beat as long as. They don't put out any counter for Inombe. They will be the ruling party or the ruling nation for PvP. Okay, next would be Wasted Red. Why is Wasted Red on number two, not Greenland? Okay, two heroes play a particular role here in terms of usage. Garf, because Garf recently had a bump in usage because of the improvement of her kit, uh, FC and Fated character. FC Rudley, I've seen splashed with a lot of, you know, with a lot of, um, with a lot of hero, or sorry, with a lot of other teams. I've seen him splashed in Lenombe. I've seen him splashed in Greenland together with Schmid. So again, in terms of usage, they are still top, um, close to, close to number one. So I think, uh, as, as you've seen, Rudley is second in usage. And FC Maggie is actually climbing the ladder because again, FC Maggie is a first guardian and she really plays a big part in terms of defense for PvP. That is why I think she's climbing. People are actually wise enough right now um, to consider also defense uh, during PvP because again, it's um, you're not you're not really um, battling a live battle like the arc burst that we're getting soon so more or less um defense plays a big part as well in winning in in, in pvp especially or the best junior especially um defense actually has a bigger point or bigger points in terms of the ranking so again people are giving premium that is why maggie is here for greenland you have their fc rera fc battery fc talia so the big three Minus Tantalo. Um, again, Tantalo, sorry for him. He has been sidelined to the bench. But these three, again, have been solid since day one. Um, I actually, in a way, I have regretted not, you know, um, leveling up my Greenland. They're actually a, a ways to go in terms of uh, building them in terms of um, because I actually prioritize Astoria's Republic so it, but but it's okay so Wasted Red and uh, Astoria's for me and as well as Vagabond but again um, I'm still in the works in in doing in fixing my Greenland teams a niche potential signature force they're a team to reckon with since day one so for those who have stuck with Greenland I'm sure they are happy um, that they have, you know, um, 
Greenland is actually good for defense. That is my, you know, my my take. The best team for defense from what I've seen is going to be Greenland. The the, the team with Rara, Bath, Italia, Rudley, and um, Schmidt. It's really a hard to crack. It, that, that team is actually really hard to crack. So more or less very good defensive team and uh, still um, I'd go, you know, I, I, I would love to have that uh, uh, choice uh, whether I could use Wasted Red or Majority of Greenland. But again, so I I don't have a good Greenland team right now. So that is actually my regret. And okay, also for Vagabond, you have FC Schmidt. So hopefully we get FC FC Awaken Zeon soon to join FC Schmidt. So that would be interesting. Uh, on the new dynamic of PvP again. Um, the one-year anniversary for Global is nearing. It's going to be on May 28th. I'm seeing a lot of teasers out there. Uh, new Fate course, probably just aesthetics. Um, beautiful design as well. So more or less, I'm looking forward to that. Okay, so guys, thank you very much for making it to the end of this video. So... For those who haven't subscribed yet to my channel, please do. Um, this helps my channel a lot. Okay, guys, for updated Exos Years content, please subscribe. So it's down there below. Anyway, guys, take care. Stay safe. This is The Warden, and I'm out of here.